Hey guys, today we're talking about centrophenoxine. All right, just a brief overview about centrophenoxine. This is actually a cholinergic compound, and it's a prodrug for something called DMAE, and that helps to improve memory, learning ability, and there's a lot of different studies about Alzheimer's and senile dementia. Now, there are a little a few side effects. Some people can complain about restlessness or dizziness, uh, but we'll talk about that in the, the benefits and the side effects section. So the main benefits, as we mentioned, for centrophenoxine are regarding memory formation. And a lot of this happens through the cholinergic system. Uh, there's an increase in cholinergic activity with centrophenoxine, and there's a number of studies in senile dementia patients, one of which was an eight-week-long study where they showed significant results for, for people who are in early stages of senile dementia. Uh, there's a lot of evidence that suggests it can and also help with people who are in uh, early stages of Alzheimer's as well to reduce some of these, these early symptoms. Now, it can actually be useful as an anti-aging uh, nootropic as well. There's some studies to suggest improvements of anywhere between 30 to 35 percent. And most of this is in animals that haven't really done any human longevity studies yet, but it is nice to see those things coming about. So let's talk a little bit more about the side effects. So some people who have been taking centrophenoxine complain about a few different side effects, but there aren't a lot of studies that are currently available right now. It's a relatively new nootropic drug. Uh, some of the, the people on Reddit and Longevity have talked about things like uh, restlessness, especially taking it late at night because it interacts with the cholinergic system. Uh, sometimes the acetylcholine can make people feel a little... Uh, concentrated on their work and have a hard time going to sleep right away. So insomnia can be kind of a problem. And the same thing with, with the feelings of dizziness or kind of disorientation as well. Most of this is rare. It's a, very com it's a very uncommon occurrence, but it could happen. So it's something you want to be aware of when you're taking the nootropic. Also, anyone who's a, a female of child rearing age, just keep in mind that DMAE and Centrophenoxine have effects for uh, for the, the unborn children. A lot of times they can have effects related to the metabolism with a child that can lead to birth defects, for example. So if you are a woman and you're trying to conceive, uh, we would not recommend you take centrophenoxine. And I personally have never used it, but if you look at Examine, for example, uh, and you look at some of the, the editors uh, analysis there, it seems that people are really, really enthusiastic about the drug, and Curtis Frank uh, especially talks a lot about how how much improvement can be seen through centrophenoxine. So we suggest a recommended vendor, which is uh, Nootropics Depot. They've got a small little 25-gram bottle. Now, Nootropics Depot is a re our recommended vendor because so many of their products have HPLC analysis. They have third-party verification and, uh, and a lot of different uh, testing for your safety that other businesses don't have. So again, we, we, we trust centrophenoxine uh, to to Nootropics Depot. If you want to learn more, then I would suggest you click above. And if you're not interested in, in buying Centrophenoxine for memory improvement, then I hope you've enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time.